Piper Richardson was a great contributor to the Canadian Scottish during World War I. In those days, the Pipers went overseas and fought on the battle lines with the troops. At the age of 21, he was in the trenches in the Battle of the Somme, which was probably the largest battle that the regiment fought in, in terms of casualties. The award of the Victoria Cross is the highest award that is issued in the British Empire and the Commonwealth for conspicuous bravery in the height of battle. Piper Richardson was awarded this because the fact that the troops were stalled, were not able to advance further because of the shell fire that they were faced with, and he got up on top and exposed himself to open fire. He played his pipes, played several tunes, and that motivated the men to get out of the trenches and attack the wire fence, the barbed wire fence, that were stopping their advance. That is what won the day. It gives them spirit, it gives them wind, as what he would say, to get up and do the impossible. Today's ceremony is to memorialize the 158 casualties that the Canadian Armed Forces suffered during the Afghanistan campaign, several of which are Victoria lads that lost their lives. when they're marching into battle, or even when they're marching on parade squares. It gets the soldiers standing upright and marching very smartly. I've been out of the regiment for some 50 years, and it still motivates me when I hear them marching down. Piper Richardson said it himself in 1916. It gives him wind. We've been making Piper's Pale Ale for over two decades, and we continue to make this fantastic beer to pay tribute to Piper Richardson and all the brave men and women who have served us here in Canada. During the month of November, we'll be donating $1 of every six pack sold and $25 from every keg sold to Wounded Warriors Canada.